are some of the members of the Upper East Smith Energy Environment Green Science Club, and our main focus is to make our school greener. The following presentation will show some of the highlights that the Green Science Club has done here at Upper East Smith, and will continue to do. We hope that you enjoy it. Keep Smith open! To all Energy Environment Green Science Club members, or anyone interested in joining, from Mr. White and Ms. Kosowski. We created the name Energy Environment Green Science Club because the energy and the environment are related to our efforts to make the school greener. Welcome to our weekly meeting of the Energy Environment Green Science Club. <laughs> this video will show what we have done as a science club. If the school gets phased out, we will lose everything we've worked hard for, and we'll lose the great opportunity of this after school club and many others at Alfred e. Smith. To learn more about being greener, we took field trips, and on one of them, we interviewed Adrian Bonipa. How would a green move benefit us economically, uh, environmentally, and socially? Ah, great question. Yeah, so far, two very good questions. We have been working with Sustainable South Bronx and the City Gardens Club of New York City on a green roof project. We will put a 2,000 square foot green roof on our school, scheduled to be installed this April 22nd. Earth Day. A green roof will provide environmental and educational benefits. I thought it was good. I thought she's, she's really smart. She knows what she's doing. She knows what she wants. Um, she knows, I, I know where she's going, like, you could just, I, the best, it was a magnificent experience, magnificent. Come in, you know, zoom in. See right here? You would find this in a salad of yours. Come closer. See, we have tomatoes here, but they haven't, we're not, they're not ready yet, that's why they they have, they have a shown of a color yellowish greenish. The red ones are really the other ones that are ready. They're nice and fresh. What's unique about Smith is that we learn the same trades that are required for installing innovative projects like a green roof. The science club took measurements, put them on a computer using AutoCAD, used the skilled drawings to illustrate how we'd like the roof to look. Finally, we used computer aided designs programs to help us determine solar radiation potential on the site. Please consider this innovation, innovative educational project and the many others that Smith offers. We are a unique school helping Smith and environment. What's the purpose of a green roof? What do you know? Go. You say it rains a lot, yeah. the soil will um, act like a sponge and like absorb some of the water instead of having flooding. Um, we have more oxygen in the air because trees and plants produce oxygen um, and they also take in carbon dioxide which they can take in from these cars. This is like we're doing the energy audit to switch out all these black bulbs that were in our in here, the current ones that's in my house. As our club name implies, we discuss topics that relate to energy and the environment. Being in a career and technical educational high school, this is very important. What we learned in our school, we take to our communities. For one project, we did energy audits on our homes. We identified that a large part of our electricity bill comes from lighting. So to fix this, we participated in a service learning project where we changed incandescent light bulbs to energy efficient compact fluorescent light bulbs. We changed hundreds of bulbs and saved each home on an average of $200 per year on electricity. Please consider the future students to offer these men.